Every day we come into contact with thousands of substances. Think of plastic cups when you drink coffee or pesticides on fruits we eat. However, we don't really know what these substances do to our health. Some of them seem safe, but if we are exposed to them over long periods of time, even in small amounts, they can interfere with our hormone systems. Eventually this can lead to diabetes, obesity, infertility or even cancer. I'm researching how we can reliably test which substances may disrupt our hormones. I'm focusing on the thyroid, a key organ in our hormone system. It produces several hormones to regulate, for example, our appetite or temperature. If the thyroid doesn't work properly, you can become ill. Because there are so many substances in our daily environment, we have to test thousands of them to see which one uh, may disrupt the thyroid function. Of course, we cannot try this out on humans, and therefore we are creating miniature models of the thyroid in the lab and observe how they respond to those substances. Our team has developed a new bioreactor, a type of vessel in which we can grow mini thyroids made from stem cells of mice or humans. We designed it so that the environmental conditions in this vessel, such as temperature, resemble those of a real thyroid as much as possible. Uh, in special bioreactor batteries, we can make many of these mini thyroids at the same time. And this is useful because we can test different conditions at the same time. We then expose the mini thyroids to various substances in different amounts for a defined period of time to see which ones may be harmful. Meanwhile, we have collected a lot of data and can use our mini thyroids to better predict which substances may disrupt our thyroids. In the future, we will hopefully also be able to see earlier which substances could cause health problems in the long term. This way, we hope to make our daily environment safer for our health.